As a dean, he has been instrumental in uh, setting up pillars for Indigenous reconciliation, social justice, uh, EDI, and those have become unbreakable pillars uh, within our institution. Uh, he's developed leading practices for anti-racism. I can't think of anyone more deserving of this award when you consider the totality of his career. I would just like to congratulate Brian on receiving the doctor's um, Manitoba Distinguished Service Award. I couldn't think of a more deserving person and I want to thank him for decades of inspiring leadership in our province. It's nice to be recognized by your peers at any time, but I, I think it's just a reflection uh, of the roles I've had and uh, the remarkable people I've been able to work with. and We've been able to move the dial in a few areas, so it's, uh, it's satisfying. I'm just heading into retirement and it's a nice way to get there. An issue in this country involving health care, it's substantively about the health of Indigenous people. And I started as a uh, medical student and really caught the bug, which really was a reflection of uh, the huge inequities in health access and health outcomes that uh, just can't be ignored despite the fact that they have been ignored for generations. I think he's deserving of this award because of the numerous impacts he's made on, um, on the health system here in the province of Manitoba uh, and at the University of Manitoba. You know, I, I think in so many ways, Brian has been the inspirational leader um, that um, has driven a lot of these innovations within our university.